It's Mason and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, I did this half cut crease look for y'all. The reason why it's a half cut crease is because normally where the nude part of my eye is, normally you put glitter there, but I decided I just want to keep it nude and keep it a half cut crease. So I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If y'all did, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe down below, and comment. And let's just get on with the video. So I'm starting out with the skin today, and I'm going in with my Maybelline Baby Skin Primer and putting it on this brush and putting that all over my face. Now once that is on my face, I'm just going to let it dry for a minute. Now once it's dried, I'm going to go in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills Stick Foundation and just put that all over my face. Once that is all over my face, I'm going to go in with my Damp Beauty Sponge and blend that all out. Now once I'm done foundation, I'm just going in with my Sephora concealer in the shade Bright Future and going in with that under my eyes. Then once I'm done blending that out, I'm going in with my L'Oreal Paris True Match powder with this big fluffy brush and putting that on my face. Now once that is done, I'm going in with my Icing Instant Bronzer with this angled brush and putting that on my cheekbones. Now once that is done, I'm going in with my 35 OS palette from Morphe and with this top shade over here and using that as a highlight. Now once my base is done, I'm going in with my e.l.f. pomade and powder little compact thing and with an angled brush going in in my eyebrows. So this brow is done and I just got this product about a few days ago. It's this e.l.f. waxing stick and I think it's supposed to be like another alternative for like brow gel and it's literally just like this stick of wax basically and you just run that over your brows to make them stick in place so I'm gonna try this out. It feels really good so I'm, I'm gonna give this a plus. It works really good. Now I'm gonna do my right eyebrow off camera. Now that both of my eyebrows are completely done, let's move on to the eyes. So as you can probably tell by the title, I'm doing this half cut crease. For this look, I'm going in with my Morphe 35OM palette. So again, I'm going in with that scotch tape on my eye right there. Again, I put it where the bottom of my eye and the top of my eye meet, and I just go out from there. Now I am taking the third shade on the top row and putting that all over my lid. Then I'm going in with the first shade on the top row and putting that over that to make it a little more paler. Then once that's done, I'm going in with the third shade on the second row and putting that in my crease. Then once that's done, I'm going in with the last shade in the second to last row and the second to last shade in the second row and putting that in my crease as well. Then once that is in my crease, I'm going in with a big fluffy brush and blending that out. Once that is all blended out, I'm going in with the first shade in the last row, the last shade in the second to last row, and the fifth shades in the third and fourth and row. And I'm putting that on the outside corner of my crease. Then once that is on my lid, I'm taking my big fluffy brush and blending that all out again. Once that is all blended out, I'm going in with the second to last shade in the last row, the last shade on the second to last row, the sixth shade on the second row, and the fifth shade on the third and fourth I'm row. I'm just going to blend this together on my brush and put that in my crease as well. Then I'm taking my big fluffy brush again and blending that out. So now we are done with the top portion of my eye with the eyeshadow. Now I'm gonna go in with my Sephora Concealer Bright Future and put that concealer on my lid. So I'm putting the concealer on my lid of my eye I'm going to stop about a little bit more than halfway when I get in my eye. As you can see, I put the concealer on my eyelid and about a little bit more than halfway across my eye. Then I'm going back in with my Morphe palette and going in with the first shade in the top row and just setting that concealer with that. 
and you set your concealer so it doesn't crease or it doesn't go onto your eyelid and make random concealer marks because you don't want that because you don't want to waste all of your hard work that you have just done. Once I'm done setting my eye with that, I'm going to go in with that mixture that I did previously and I'm just going to blend out that harsh line from the concealer to the eyeshadow. So as you can see, I blended it into each other. Next, I'm going to go in with my Forever 21 palette in the shade Natural and go in with that black shade right there and use a little flat top brush and put the black shadow on that and just run that along the line of the tape. Now once I'm done sketching out my wing, I'm going to go in with my Maybelline Master Precise Eyeliner and just fill in the rest. Now once my wing is all done, I'm just going to take off the tape. Now once the tape is off, I'm just going to go in with the same mixture that I went in previously, previously, and just put that on my bottom lash line. Now that we are done my eyeshadow and everything else, I'm just going to go in with my eyelash curler and curl my lashes up. Once my lashes are curled, I'm going in with my Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara and put that all over my lashes. I'm just going to go in with my Maybelline The Falsies Volume Express Waterproof Mascara and put that on my bottom lashes. Now I'm done this eye and now I'm just going to do this eye off camera to save time. So now my other eye is done, and also while y'all were gone, I did highlighter on my nose and on my cupid's bow of my lips. So for lips today, I'm just going to use my Clinique Quick Liner in the shade 40 Neutrality and just line my lips with that. Now once that is all over my lips, I'm just going to go in with this Forever 21 Liquid Lipstick in the shade Dusty Pink and put that all over my lips. So just like I said in my last video, this color is a little too pink for me, so I'm just going to go in with my Milani Liquid Lipstick in the shade Honey and put that also like in the little center of my lips. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, comment down below, and also subscribe. Follow all my social medias. There will be links down below for Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat. And I will see you guys next Saturday with another new video. Peace out. I'm just gonna go in with a little, little, little. Follow all my social media. So my mom and dad are stopping to the shower right now, and that's why that noise is there. I'm sorry. <sighs> Your boy's fat.